Hi, I'm Frederico, and this is my baby son, Noah. I just want to start with this because I want you to have a good look at his face before he disappears, it goes playing somewhere else. Have a good look at his face, both sides, this side, this side, uh huh, and that side, this side, the other side. Well done. <laughs> And only the chest, everything show. Mm -hmm. And you can see all nice and clear, all right? Right, this is my baby. I'll tell you why I did that, just in a minute. Right, you saw my child, and you can see myself in real life, in a real video. And the reason I did that, because uh, lots of people have their pictures before and after pictures and you can see clearly they have photoshopped and you know they put massive light on one of the pictures illuminated so much that it just clears everything and it's just like glamorous and we put makeup on uh, so uh, no i'm not doing that it's real life video and you can see his skin and you can see my skin uh, you can see all around me and you know uh, and i'm going to tell you my story and i'm going to tell you the story of my child a few years ago uh, to be exact in 2015 i developed psoriasis and i know you're here because you have psoriasis and you don't know what to do with it you're suffering you've been suffering probably for years and you know i don't blame you because you've been going same as me from doctor to doctors and all they do is just giving you topical lotions and creams uh, all steroid-based creams uh, that all they do is just basically cosmetically, it just loosens the peeling skin, it gets rid of that, and it looks like nice and clear, but it's not clear because you st the itch is still there, the root cause of the problem is still there. Uh, it thins your skin and in fact is counterproductive because uh, it's harmful and it's got its own side effects. Now, uh, my psoriasis started uh, with a peely uh, patch of skin here or on top of my eyelid and then it went on well at least that's where I noticed it anyway uh, it could have been other places but I noticed it here because it's annoying and it was itching and then it was peeling and then it went on uh, the, the scalp of my head all around it behind my ears my chest very annoying very itchy and my private area it was very, very annoying and itchy, and uh, I was going through uh, this vicious cycle of itching, peeling, wounding myself, bleeding, and, and you know, going through it again and again, over and over, days and nights, especially at nights, and I know what the pain is, and I know you'd be probably itching around your elbows and knees, uh, those joints usually have problematic uh, skin issues. Uh, I didn't have that. Uh, uh, mine was mainly around my private area and uh, chest and behind ears and you know those kind of things. Uh, I just told you. I went through years of suffering uh, with this nasty disease. Uh, I say disease because I've been told that many times by these doctors this is a disease and, and that's just the quote from the doctors because they like to, especially these days, they like to refer to any kind of condition as a disease, uh, meaning and implying that there is no cure for it. I'm here as a first time guinea pig for you to tell you there is a cure and you need to believe that. You need to believe that and watch the rest of this. I'll explain right here what happened. I'm not playing games here. I'm not beating about the bush. I'm not trying to show you something that is not true. This is me. I'm not a corporation. I'm not a big company. This is my house. This is my room. And I'm not a big businessman. I went from doctor to doctors. And like I said, all they did was just to tell me that there is no cure. There is no cure. And you just have to put up with it and you just have to live with it and just use this cream. It just makes it livable, makes it basically more bearable and it doesn't deal with the root cause of the problem. I never took that as an answer. I'm that kind of person, I don't take no for an answer. I knew deep down that there is a cure. 
And that cure has to be from within. Because that's just how it is, how things are. You know, if you're trying to clear your skin uh, with cosmetics or put lotion on or cream on and, and just get rid of the peely skin just to make it look nicer and more pleasant, um, you're not dealing with, this, with the source of the issue, with the root cause of the problem. It's the same as going and putting wallpaper over massive cracks of walls. Your house has got probably a foundational problem. You have to deal with the foundation. Your house is probably subsiding and it's got all those cracks and it's showing that. Your body is the same. You can't just put wallpaper and cosmetically uh, clear it and make it appear nice. Uh, you have to deal with the root cause of the problem. You have to deal with the foundational problem. And that has to be from within. Once you sort the root cause of the problem from within, then that will manifest itself on the appearance, on the outside, and you can see it and everybody can see it. And, and that is going to be staying with you. And that's natural. And that's true. It's not fake. And you'll get rid of all that itch problem. Now, my baby also, you saw in the video, Clearly, his skin is completely clear and he has no problems whatsoever. And uh, I'll show you his pictures from before. His face was obviously, you can see in the pictures, problematic and uh, it was peeling and leaking. And, and, you know, it was heartbreaking just to look at. And I, I thought, I have to find a cure for this. Uh, first, try it on myself and then give it to my baby once I know the cure works, then uh, it works for the baby as well, which it did, as you can see. Now, back to the story, I went to, from doctors to doctors. I went even to Chinese doctors. I went through um, massage therapy, acupuncture therapy, all sorts of things, and none of them dealt with the root cause of the problem. They all did a little bit of here and a little bit of that, and, and you could see some sort of a little bit of result, but none of them really uh, completely healed me. Not to mention the fact that I spent a lot of money in the meantime to just uh, receive all those treatments. My penny finally dropped when I had a conversation with my uh, parents who are uh, in the country of my origin. And when I told them about the issue, they just thought, we've never heard of such thing. And um, and then my penny dropped because I remembered my childhood and I just thought, well, yeah, I'd never heard and I'd never seen anybody like that with those kind of conditions. Uh, and started doing uh, a lot of research and found out, yes, it is true. Uh, it's mainly in the Western uh, countries that we have these conditions and it is down to our diet. A horrible diet. Um, I did a bit of studies uh, on Avicenna. Avicenna has written lots and lots of books uh, and a few of volumes of his books are just on human body, not to mention the rest about, you know, astrology and all the other things. Uh, he has written about human body and how it functions and how we have to keep, keep it in, in uh, tip-top shape and healthy and you know how they go wrong and how they malfunction um, I'm not going into details of all that because there's a lot of information there and I'm not going to bore you in this little video just to say that in every human being uh, there are four natures at work uh, these are fire wind earth and water. Now, all these four natures have to be in total balance and equilibrium for your body to function properly and be healthy. If any of them go out of balance, then you, you show you manifest some sort of an issue. Your body is created to give indications of some sort of a malfunction, some sort of problems, your nails, your toes, your tongue, your eyes, 
your hair, your eyebrows, all of these indicate something. Uh, they manifest the, the, the problems from within. If there is a problem from inside, even the acne is where they are on the on if they're on your forehead if they're on your cheeks if they're on your nose each one of them indicate different things so you need to know them uh, you need to know what they're indicating it's the same as the, the signal lamps and signal indicators in your car they all indicate something if the fuel is down it indicates something if it's um, the oil uh, that's down uh, there is another uh, lamp coming on uh, or any indication uh, if the engine is too hot there is an indication indication showing that your engine is uh, too hot so uh, if if man can make that kind of machine to show those indications to make it basically idiot proof for people to uh, make it right so you know fill the tank uh, fill the oil top it up and this kind of things then obviously our creator have made us in a way we show uh, in our appearance is just an indication of our health so that is why i really personally believe that there is a cure and that cure has to be from within and that has to be natural so i did more and more research and i found more and more items and ingredients that are natural and and within your reach in fact some of you might have some of these ingredients right now in your kitchen uh, so it's not like we're asking you to find some teardrops of an ant and mix it with the sting of a bee and mix it with some special honey that's made of this flower that only grows one day a year in some remote island in Japan and then eat it every night and that will cure you. We're not, <laughs> we're not telling you that. We're not going to tell you uh, you have to be a vegetarian because I know some people say oh yeah well, you probably want me to, to be vegetarian I'm a carnival myself and I'm, I'm not going to tell you you have to stop eating meat no I'm not asking you that uh, and and the, the fact is everything is available everything you can source them you can find the resources you can come directly to us and buy them because the thing is uh, I've done the hard work for you. I've spent a lot of money and a lot of time and I've gone through a lot of pain and suffering, basically being a guinea pig for you. Now, I didn't know I was going to be a guinea pig for you. I was doing it for me. I did it for me and then I did it for my child. And my child is healed and cured, as you can see. And, and I, as you can see, uh, I have no issues whatsoever as far as the skin and I'm back on normal diet now although I'm topping my diet with uh, the oil that I've made and you know with the mixture of oil that I have uh, the, the concoction I call it that I've made and uh, that bolsters uh, your immune system especially particularly in this time um, with what's going on in the world you definitely need to have a strong immune system and this definitely does that this bolsters your immune system in brackets i'll tell you another little short story uh, we had an uh, occasion that all my family my wife my children um, they all got sick they all had uh, diarrhea and vomiting constantly for days and it was strange because it went on for a few days uh, but i never had that and, and I tell you, we always eat the same thing, the same food. We always go to the same places and do the same things together. So uh, if it was poisoning or anything, it should have happened to me as well. Uh, or if it was any virus, any bug or anything, it should have happened to me as well, but it didn't. And the only reason that I can put that down to is because I was taking the oil and the other ones in the family weren't at the time. But now they're all we're all taking it. Even my baby is taking a little uh, half a teaspoon of that oil that I've made, and it's strengthened our immune system. And we can we know it. We know it for sure. And and you will know it when you use it. Now I'm not going to bore you with all the stories. And uh, all I'm going to say is, get that mindset uh, out of your mind completely. Get that niggly 
thought in your brain, in your mind that says there is no cure, there is no cure. And that is only because you've been in that surrounded with that community, with that surrounding, that circle of people that you have, uh, friends that you have, or doctors that have told you there is no cure, there is no cure. Get that out of your mind. That's the first step you have to take. And take that step of faith and believe there is a cure. Don't waste time. Take that step of faith. Believe it. Take either our course or jump straight to our subscription boxes and order one of those. The subscription boxes, you can cancel at any time. So there is no uh, obligation. You can just cancel at any time. Uh, however, we've also got another uh, package that you can order one time. Uh, so there is no subscription. You don't actually have subscription there. Uh, and try it for yourself. See if it works, then it continue. And if it doesn't, then you stop. And I guarantee and I promise you will come back. And the guarantee is that if you use our product, you're not happy. You haven't seen any results. Send that empty bottle back to me and I will give you a full refund. Or better than that. What else can you expect? And I do all this because I want to prove those idiots that call themselves doctors wrong. Because they are wrong. And they don't know it. The, the, the sad thing is they don't even know that they're wrong because they've been taught themselves. They've been they've gone on the course, they've been told you have to do it this way, you have to say this, you have to do that. You have to prescribe this, you have to prescribe that. And they don't know it. They haven't experienced it. Some of them might, but however, they're going by the book. I have a question from you. Which one would you go to? Would you go to a person, if you have any problem in life, if you have any problem in any area of your life, would you go to an expert who's done a course on that, who's gone through universities and got a degree on that, but has never ever felt or experienced that pain, that problem, that he's got, he's never, or she has never gone through that problem that you, you've been going to, through, that you're going through. Or you would go to a person who has actually firsthand experienced that and come out of that successfully and victoriously. Well, I'm sure your answer is the latter. You would go to the person who has experienced it firsthand. I'm that person. I'm a living proof. My child is also a living proof for you. We've done the hard work for you, so you don't have to. All you have to do, take that step of faith, believe it, and uh, order any of our subscription boxes or even this course. And if you don't, see any results then return that empty bottle and i will give you a full full refund no questions asked nothing to lose there is nothing absolutely nothing to lose right don't go away i haven't finished my wife is coming to initialize your healing process right here right now in this video and by the end of the video she's got some amazing irresistible offers and discounts Hope to see you again. Goodbye from me.